God, I need to get my shit together. I'm struggling with it today. I'm struggling with it today. I forgot to turn off the AC. I'm so excited about life, guys. Things are just, what is that? Sorry, I thought there was something on my mouth. All right, I made it up and down without knocking anything over and I'm about to because I said that out loud. All right, we're gonna, don't look at my hair. I don't care. I'm gonna have a wig on by the end of it and I'm trying to fade my dye. So like, um, I feel like people that watch my videos all the time kind of look at me like, why do you repeat the same thing all the time? Guys, I constantly, I'm getting new people that watch, especially my makeup videos, and they're just jarred by me. They're just like, I had somebody yesterday tell me how nasty my face tattoos are. Are you new here? I mean, obviously. Imagine willingly walking into an alternative space, clicking on a video, and then being like, oh my god! Anyway, um, I'm gonna be doing this entire makeup look based off of this lipstick. This lipstick that I got because an Instagram mutual had something on and it has the selfie still up. On in a selfie, uh, a lipstick color that's very, very similar. Um, and I had to have it. I had to have it and I'm me, so I didn't reach out and ask exactly what brand it was. <laughs> so, my husband went to Walmart and just tore up the aisles and found the closest thing that he could find. I think he did really well. I need to do my skincare and I need to... That's basically it. That's step one. Also, don't look at my nails. I haven't put new nails on yet. I'm terrified too. I just did like a sleep CO2 test and I'm terrified. I'm going to put a fresh set on and then I'm going to get a call from the medical supply place. Um, your doctor ordered another test because the test results didn't work. Like, what if, what if the machine was like sliding around all night and it like didn't do the thing? Because if you look at the little screen while it's on your, list, on your wrist, it's not lit up. So like, I'm terrified that I'm gonna put a fresh set on and have to rip them back off. So I'm just kind of holding off for a little while. Also, I'm gonna turn this off because it has the time on it and I don't need how slow I'm going to be shoved in my fucking face. I don't need it I'm already watching the sun outside. I, I really don't need the point driven home. Um, while I'm waiting for this to like soak into my skin, I'm not getting ready to go anywhere or do anything. <clears throat> Epps and I, it is a Saturday. We could go out and do things if we wanted to, but I don't think that we are. I really need to shave my face. I really need to do my eyebrows and shave my face. I'm just not going to do that right now. I, I just brought it up because my little tufts of hair are looking a little thick for me. I know, I know you're crawling in this seat, you thinking bitch. What the fuck are you talking about? Trust me. <laughs> they're doing their best. You're doing great, sweetie. But also, does anybody else ever have, like, I've never had this problem with any of my other piercings. Like, I have a Labray piercing. I just never wear jewelry in it because it knocks on my teeth so much. It's driving me nuts. And I have uh, my septum pierced. So, those are not things that I would think that this would happen with. But, like, and obviously I have my nose done. But my eyebrow ring like randomly sometimes will just like get super red like that i didn't do anything i didn't do anything in fact before sitting down to film this i just took a two hour nap like a really fucking good two hour nap i don't know why she's doing that I'm putting the leftovers on the backs of my hands like I'm not gonna wash them. Is it like a chunk of unblended stuff? Listen, I get people that are like, you're supposed to pack your skincare in. And the thing is like, I don't care. <laughs> That's the thing. It's like, I don't care, but I do pat this stuff in because it was expensive. So I guess I kind of do care. I do what I don't, I do what I don't. I think that describes my entire life. All right, we're using this nasty bitch. <laughs> I 
I hate looking at it. Looks at it. It's the Lottie Bubble Tea Primer. I can't look at it. Literally, I want to throw it into the wall. It's the little bubbles. It's the little bubbles. They just make me, you know, you know? I know someone knows. <laughs> Sorry, I just had to go check on my dog. All right. So I, I, I can't breathe from putting my big ass up and down the stairs. Um, we're gonna be putting on a little bit of this and a little bit of this, and it'll be more of this than this because I'm exceptionally fair today. Uh, I'm gonna use this giant thing that I got from the dollar store to blend this out because I can't find the uh, thing that I usually use. Oh my God, no. I can't find the thing that I usually use to blend it out, which is this e.l.f. foundation brush. But guys, I learned the hard way uh, not that long ago to not let this shit sit on my face because it dries down and it just, where it is, is just a fucking <laughs> patch of product and it doesn't move. And um, by me saying I can't find my makeup brush, I mean, I don't care to look for it. I mean, it's not immediately in front of me and therefore I'm not, <laughs> I just don't have it in me to tear up my makeup to look for it. I mean, I guess this is working. Oh my God. Maybe this will work, this beauty bakery brush. I keep grabbing brushes thinking that they're the right one and they're not and it's stressing me out. Maybe this is a sign I need to buy a new one because I've needed a new one for a while. The one that I have is disgusting. It's beyond like uh washing it will salvage it. It's it's gross. I think you know now's the end let her ass go in peace. This is working fine. <gasps> I was a little nervous there for a second. How did I do with my color match? I don't care. It looks fine. I, I, there's a lot. Actually, there's a lot more blending that I need to do. Oh my gosh, I'm agitated. So I just don't. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We're not off to a good start. I will tell you that much, bitch. We're not off to a very good start. I'm feeling very ashy. She's feeling... <laughs> she's feeling quite ashy. I really want to try, like I haven't done my concealer yet, but I really want to try this TikTok hack that I saw a while ago. Oh, by the way, did I tell you guys what I use? I use the Maybelline Matte and Poreless and the Revolution Super Matte. Um, I really want to try this TikTok hack that I saw not that long ago. And by not that long ago, I mean probably a fucking year ago. I have no concept of time. Um, where you like spray your foundation and shit before you're done with the rest of your face but like i think of like the fact that i would be putting more product on top of product on top of product and guys i love a good cake face i love a good cake face i love it on myself i love it on other people but the sensory issues that that could end up causing for me and not only that the texture issues that that could end up causing for me i feel like it would be one of those situations where my makeup would look really good is that on my skin is that a fucking liver spot or is that like did i put that there with something both are a possibility. This was the Milani concealer. Not a giant fan of it, but I'm using it because it's immediately in front of me and I don't feel like looking for the one that I normally use. But I feel like it would cause an issue where like my skin would look really pretty in a video, but it wouldn't look pretty face to face, which like when your skin looks pretty in videos, it usually looks great in low lighting, but then you go outside in natural lighting and it's like, oh my God, that's why I say, that's why I say what my skin looks like. What my makeup looks like in natural lighting is none of my fucking business. Let's do it. If it's too much, if I don't like it, I can always wash it off, right? I can always scrap the whole fucking video and wash it off. So I'm just doing the NYX, bear with me. And the the girl that I watch, like I don't have the TikTok, the TikTok app right now. I'm kind of thinking about re-downloading it. But um, she fucking drenched her face between layers. I don't know if I can do that. I don't know if I have it in me to do it, but let's try a couple sprays because I'm looking and feeling awfully fucking ashy, bitch.
Ugh, that was more than in just a few sprays. One thing I don't like about this is I feel like the spray is not consistent. You know what I mean? Like it's some, it hits, like, it, I don't know if there's like a clog in my nozzle or something, but like some parts of the spray are like there and other parts, like none of that hit my jaw. None of it hit my jaw, but if I sit here and I spray my jaw, I'm going to be spraying other parts of my face even more. And that sounds fucking gross. All right, I'm going to be putting on this Maybelline Lasting Fix all over my face to bake it. <laughs> I need to wake up. I need to wake up. Wake me up. Wake me up inside. I, I had an ex who used to fucking torment me with Evanescence. With that song. He would fucking torment me with it. But I feel like, you know, I haven't been with him in years. I feel like my relationship is with it is healing. <laughs> I feel like my relationship with that song, it, it slowly but surely is healing. All right. Oh, he's so, so cool, guys. Oh, he's so really not awkward at all with my baking powder on my face. All right, we're gonna be using LA Girl Brow Pomade and then uh, NYX Lift and Snatch over top of it. Oh, I feel like I need to scratch my face. I feel like I need to slap it. I feel like that's the only way it's gonna appease the itch is to just rip my skin off. Guys, this is what I mean when I say that I don't like to have too many like little hairs right here because it like dictates a lot. I look like the fucking caterpillar from Bugs Life, the beautiful butterfly. That's as good as it's coming, guys. I don't, I don't, <laughs> I can't do eyebrows. I've never had good eyebrows, not ever in my life. Uh, I think the fact that my eyebrows won't grow is proof that I'm just not, they're not meant for me. They're not meant for me. I just surrender to maybe I should wear a hat. Maybe I should just have a wig on with bang. My body is just like, stop trying to make eyebrows happen, bitch. It's not gonna happen. I like how my foundation brush was literally right in front of my fucking face. Is anybody surprised? Because I'm not. I'm going back and forth between using the Twilight palette and the Morphe palette. This Morphe palette that I have. I just peeled an eyelash off the back of this. That literally scared the shit out of me. I thought it was a dead spider. I'm not gonna lie. I had to take a minute to breathe. <laughs> I really want to do brown. Because I feel like brown would look really, really pretty with this color. And if you watched my vlog yesterday, um, I was talking about how I couldn't wait to try it on. But I needed a full face of makeup to do it. Because I didn't think that it would look pretty without it. It's so pretty. Not gonna lie, I tried it on without a full face of makeup and I loved it. If I just focused in on my mouth and not the rest of my face, I really, really liked it. In my head, I'm thinking brown. I'm thinking browns would look the best with it. I have no fucking idea what I'm doing. I think I'm just gonna do it. Oh my God, I was this close. Literally had the fucking brush in my hand to do my eyeshadow. I forgot primer. I'm gonna be using this Milani primer. It's been like 20 minutes. So much shit has happened. And by so much shit, I mean a lot of noise around me has been happening. And it like knocked the momentum right out of me. It knocked the momentum to film straight the fuck out of me. I'm just gonna do my eyeliner and try to like power through this. Cause guys, what the fuck? There was, it was so much and like all at once and then something would stop and then something else would start and it was all out of my control. I love that. 
one of my favorite things that my anxiety loves the most, my, my anxiety's BFF, is situations being out of my control. All right, I'm gonna be using the Revolution Slick Flick to do my wings. I, I was gonna do more with my um, eyeshadow, but I don't think that I'm going to, uh, because I'm not gonna lie to you, I can't find my fucking Moonstone palette. I actually got up and looked for it. I don't see it. I don't know if I took it in the bathroom or something, but it's not immediately in front of me and it's not in my bedroom. So I'm, maybe I took it in the bathroom or something or took it downstairs. I can't find it, which really upsets me and kind of pisses me off because I had this like look in mind with it and I can't find it. I will find it. I am determined. I paid like $19 for that. I paid like $19 for that. All right, let's do these fucking wings. I have no idea if they're gonna be big, small, whatever. I'm just gonna go with it. Ah, listen, I just got up to get my energy drink. Uh, I hit my ring light. It knocked over my mirror right here, which you guys never see. Um, and my energy drink just flew across the room. And it hit my iPad. Ah! And it spilled, it, it's all over my pants. But guys, if I, if it's three o'clock in the afternoon. Yeah, it's three o'clock in the afternoon. I don't have time to care. I have to keep fucking going even though I kind of feel like I'm gonna cry. I kind of feel like everything's going wrong and I'm gonna cry, but I also feel like I'm kind of spiraling a little bit and kind of like doing the thing where like any little thing is gonna feel like a big deal. So we're just gonna fucking move past it. We're just gonna move past it. At least my ring light didn't break and at least I had another energy drink in the fridge is what I'm gonna tell myself. And my iPad is okay. It's okay. <laughs> Some fucking how it's okay um we're just gonna push past it my, my my lash glue is drying down we're gonna put on some of this and then um i gotta fight where the fuck is my eyeliner oh here it is it's right in front of me it's right in front of me of course it is um i'm gonna be putting on this essence shit <laughs> it's a long name and some elf satin eyeliner we're just gonna power through this oh my god Guys, these eyelashes are acting like they don't know each other. They're acting like they never met. They don't, they're, they're acting like they, they're not sisters, cousins, friends, not even on the same side of the fucking planet. Just, look how big my fucking forehead is. Listen, it's just like my wings. One is, one short and thick and the other one's long and lean. And we're just going to ignore it, guys. We're just going to ignore it. I'm surprised I haven't scrapped this entire video and just went to bed. This is like the most simple eye look I've done in a very long time. Probably since my strawberry makeup that I did in a video that I included in a vlog. Oh, I'm gonna put a lot of glitter on it. I'm gonna fuck it up with some glitter. It has taken me so long to do this that like my baking powder is almost all the way gone. Usually whenever I go to dust my baking powder off, it's like there. It like hasn't had a chance to like melt into my skin. Oh, she's she's where she needs to be. I guess that's one good part of fucking off. But it wasn't my fault. It was just, it wasn't my fault, but it just became my problem, everything. I think I'm gonna go ahead and dust this off. What's left of it anyway? Blend it in, smudge it around. 
uh, mix it in with my oils. Uh, the, the whole like spraying uh, shit thing didn't like make me feel gross like I thought it was going to, but like the chick that I took that tip from, she would like literally put down like her foundation or she would do like, she would do like her um, primer spray, uh, foundation spray, eye concealer spray, powder spray. Ooh, ooh. Like I'm for it if you can handle it, but this bitch with my fucking sensory issues, never. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put some, some glitter on because of course I am. Because of course I am, and I think that's going to be the thing that makes me feel better about how simple this eye look is. <laughs> I think that's going to be the thing. If I could, it, When I get done with this video, I am tearing up my house. I honestly, I my Moonstone palette is like one of my favorite palettes that I've ever owned. And I... If I can't find it, I will rebuy it. Like, I struggled with spending $19 on it. It is worth twice that. To be honest with you, it's worth twice that. I'm wondering if I took it downstairs, like into my living room or something. That is a huge, huge, huge possibility. All right, let's put this fucking glitter on. It's so subtle. That's all right. That's all right. I haven't put in my lip. Put in. I haven't 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 put in on. I haven't put on. Put it. Put on my lipstick yet or any of my other stuff. I think I got glitter in my eye. Today's just going very swell. I'm dying. I kind of feel like it. I just had to run downstairs and check the mail really quick. It's three o'clock in the fucking afternoon and the mail hasn't ran yet and it's going to run because I have informed delivery. But then I had to stop and talk to Dee for a little bit and he had to tell me a lot about Friday Night Funkin' Lore. I don't know anything about it. I just know his favorite character is some lemon thing that he has a plushie of. So we were kind of playing with that for a minute. Ah, okay. We're fine. Everything's fine. Is my mirror warped or is my camera warped? Because I swear to God, when I look in my mirror, my forehead kind of looks semi-normal. And then I look at my camera and I'm like, wait, is it so big? Why are you so big? Is it because you're full of secrets? Um, anyways, I'm going to use this Maybelline. I'm very, very lightly going to use the Maybelline City Bronzer. My dog is barking at something. It's not him, it's the neighbor's dog. I'm so shocked. I love these little son of a bitch. <laughs> what wild sesame street brushes. I love them. Oh my god, I love them. I'm putting on some uh some CoverGirl True Blend So Flush. Like part of me wants to do like heavy blush with this lipstick, but I'm gonna see how I'm feeling once I get it on. Like once I get the lipstick on, if I wanna like put more on. It's so pretty. I can't wait to put it on and show you guys. I can't wait to put it on and show you guys what it looks like. I'm so fucking stressed out right now. I'm, I'm so fucking stressed out right now. Da, 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 da. Ow. Uh, anyways, <laughs> this is the Revlon Color Say Suede Ink in the shade in the zone. And I purposely did not put any kind of like lip oils on or anything. Um, because I kind of like, like yesterday when I put it on, my lips were dry and I kind of liked how it looked in my crusty lips. Um, this is what it looks like. Like this is what the cap looks like. And this is what it looks like. I think it's pretty close. I think it's pretty close. And yesterday when I tried it on, I did not line my lips, which is very telling because I usually line my lips in black always, but I feel like it'll change the color of this so much that I don't want to do that. Will it bleed? Probably, but oh wow. Oh wow. I'm hoping I'm not hyping this up from memory, <laughs> like, like wrongly, you know what I mean?
Guys, I'm usually not a fan of red. I usually hate how I look in red. This is a shade of red. It's like a brownish red. I love it. I think it's so cute. I think it's really pretty. I, I don't know. I said something nice, which means inevitably somebody's going to be mean. I kind of want to style my wig, but I don't think that I have time in this vlog. Like, for this vlog, because it's already uh, 3.30. It's already fucking 3.30. Can you even see this color? I feel like in real life, it's way darker, way browner than it is in my camera. I love it, guys. It looks so good. You sound like Jennifer Coolidge. Yes. Yes, I do. Anyway, I kind of like really, really, really want to style my wig because I feel like there's just not enough going on right now with me and it's kind of bothering me, but I don't have enough time to include it in this video. So I'm just going to say um, bye to you guys and I will see you tomorrow and I'm not going to flip you off because my nails are gross. Boy, um, editing me, I realized that I said this vlog. I feel like I don't have time in this vlog. This is not a vlog. Obviously, it's just a makeup video. Uh, I, I just get used to saying things and they come out. So don't bring it up. All right, boy.